Dear diary, I've woken up. But the truth is unfortunately still truth. Lydia is dead. And we are alone out here. It's Skyrim. Stormcloaks stole her from me and from Whiterun and from the people of Skyrim. She was a beautiful and stalwart defender. I respected her. I needed her. And I will avenge her. Both from the Stormcloaks and from the dragons and from anyone in this godless world. seeks to put their own interests above the majority. Scoop. Frickin' scoop. And we're here completing a mission for the Greybeards. They want me to retrieve the hall, horn of the Windwalker, I think was his name. I'll check it in the journal in, 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 a, in, a, in a second. Might be Windmaker. But this means... Huh. This means we're heading back to the tombs. Yeah. And yeah, I'm still scared. And yeah... <laughs> we're still gonna get hurt. I have a new purpose. You found anger. These thralls of yours are slower than Arsonians in a blizzard. Feel free to grab a pick and help them out. I prefer not to sully myself with manual labor. There goes another one. Bah, weak willed rabble. Even dead, they're almost useless. Were they? They seem less intelligent each time you raid them. Mages reanimating as long as the they dead. Can swing a pickaxe where I tell them they're as smart as we need them to be. You hear that? The others must have found something. We'd better go see. These can tend to themselves for a few minutes. Searching. I bet you they're looking at the same thing I am. Off she goes. So maybe it won't just be the undead. Really accompany us here. Spider eggs. That wasn't what I meant, but. Mm. Who puts a skull next to the bread? Seriously, who puts a skull next to the bread? I and mean, that's all kinds of wrong, isn't it? I was trying to sneak up on that, but I'll be honest, it didn't quite work. He turned around and hit me in the face. <laughs> now, can I raise him myself? I have to say, my fire skills have been improving. Ugh, my ability to do things with the dead is terrible. Now, <laughs> obviously, if I was back in the wasteland and I said a sentence like that, I would have just freaked myself out. However, down here, that seems to be practically normal. A little bit of necromancy seems to make the world go round up it right down here. Especially while in a tomb. Now, 
I have that new spell, candlelight. It would more than happily light this whole place up. However, the downside would be... Jesus. What the heck is going on? Something got that. Oh, God. Jesus, how many of them are there? Down you go, down you go. Anyone still alive in that big flaming, smoking ruin? Okay, we seem to be the last living ones here. Success. Got snack, helps to pass the time of course. A little wedge. Oh crap! Oh no 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 you don't, no you don't. If anyone that's gonna hear is gonna be raising the dead, it's gonna be frickin' me. You're right, we're gonna have to heal ourselves up if we're gonna take this thing down. He's got one of those wards to shield himself from my magic. But, in which case, it might be good. For us to start using shock magic, but he is struggling. And I think ah, we got him. We got him. I might not be a clever enough conjurer, I might not be a clever enough restorer, but hey, I can blow stuff up with my powers. Come on. Little necromage. Oh, God, there's this big smoldering mess down here. God, there appears to have been about three or four scourges under that. Whoops. Yep, yeah, we caused a mess. We caused a mess. Right, come on, Minty. You know, as soon as I said Minty there, obviously then look for Lydia. She's not here. Dealing down here with mages, dragors. Goodness knows what else. This could be their headquarters. You know, I take that back. This is actually just urns. This is 
places where the dead have been lain. And I don't want to spend my time putting my hands rummaging through the dead. Minty, I think that's probably your job. Ooh. But I will read any books that I think will improve my abilities. Now remember, that's why we're doing this, Minty. I'm not interested in the horn. Greybeards are. The greybeards are the key to stopping the dragons. Greybeards are the key to making me the most powerful archmage. Hopefully, there has been. Which is the key to stopping the storm cloaks, stopping this war. Which is a good thing. So come along, Mint. Stop looking so gloomy about it all. nearby? Or just a bucket. Right, Minty, come on, crash down, crash. We're gonna sneak. We're gonna try and we're gonna be subtle. There's something else alive down here. Yep. Yep. Definitely something else alive down here. Definitely something alive else alive, don't it? Mm. Alright, go and get mitts. Whoa! Okay, never mind. I got him. Ah, <laughs> yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. That's a first. I think I've taken down one in one hit, though. We are getting stronger. means he's better than Minty. If he's better than Minty, then come along, you can be the new Minty. Ah. Oh. You're fine. The old Minty can be the old Minty. Welcome back, Minty. Ah, the torch just went out. You only heard it when the torch goes out. Don't try. to go that way for the horn. <laughs> Which sounds ruder than I anticipated. Only if I was in a laughing mood. Points. Lots of points. Maybe it'll pay the boatsman on the way across. Maybe. You know the afterlife. Minty. It is an interesting question. One which no one really can have the answers. You know whether you come back as a walking, talking drugger. Whether you're reborn in a strange land in a strange place with a strange quest. Whether you're uploaded to a strange computer where you... Meet up with 
the souls of those you kill. None of us can know. None of us can guess. But we do the best with what we have. I do hope that Lydia has gone on somewhere. She enjoys. I'm sure wherever she is, she's kicking ass. Good potions. It's nice, awesome. good helmets. Especially when I first arrived in Skyrim, I really liked the style of those helmets. That was before we discovered the magic. <laughs> or did the magic discover us? Did the magic discover us, Minty? That is the question. Am I the puppeteer or the puppet? Actually, you know what, Minty? That's a very good question. Why am I here in Skyrim? Put me here. Put me in this body. Who put me here in this body at this time in this place? For what purpose? For what reason? For what goal? And for how long? Come down, come down. Whoa! Oh, crap. Oh, that's Minty. It's daylight. There's a hole. I've let some trees grow down it. Looks like there's some water down there as well. Whoa! God, don't sneak up behind me like that. Oh, jeez. Minty. This sake, it's creepy enough down here already without you doing that. Okay? Why is everything creaking? Seriously, everything is creaking. I know, like, you just creak anyway because you're dead, but seriously, like, everything else is just creak. I feel like I want to say I see I see dead people, but I feel that's been said before far better than I can do it. Huh. Where? There. Now. You know, in the moonlight, it really brings out your eyes. No, really, it's brought out your eyes. It's hanging down. It's hanging off. I'm tempted to use that light thing just to go above my head, but then everything will see me coming. Everything will be like, hmm, what's that large ball of light coming towards me? Which then gives me the alternative choice to sneak around. Really, really scared. Which I think is the better alternative, but, you know, who knows? Seriously, everything is moving. I can... Uh, Jesus! I swear everything is moving. I can hear just stuff all around me. It's on my right, it's on my left. Just the whole freaking place is freaking moving. There, there, there. Behind you, behind you, behind you, behind you. I'm not entirely sure why I sneak and then do that, because it probably kills the snake. But still, the principle is the same. I'm not sure what the principle is. At the moment, the principle is me going... Jah. Right. Fine. Whoa. Oh, hello. 
someone through there. Minty? Is that Minty? No, that's not Minty. Ah, oh, God. Hopefully Minty's still around somewhere. Minty? No. Minty? No, that's a wall. Easy mistake to make, though. Minty, Minty, I'm feeling a little bit alone. Here, you Minty, or are you Minty? It's hard to tell one corpse from another. Did I just trigger another? What the frick just happened? Alright, that was all kinds of weird. Oh, I'm in my own head here. I really, really, really miss, wish Lydia was here. Ow, now I'm punching the dead. Welcome back, Minty. Excellent crotch shot. Excellent crotch shot. There's food here. Food for the living. Lots and lots and lots of cheese. Like, like, like all cheese. And a throat. <laughs> what do you think, Mindy? Go on. Does it suit me? You can be honest. Is it my kind of throne? Or does it need more feathers? I think it needs more feathers. You could have a little side throne. I'm not sure. That, I, I think the light's good. It helps to, you know, make me look more gloriful. But it's not about the ego, okay? Oh, potions are good, potions are good. Without Lydia around. God, I'm really moping. Really moping. I feel it's deserved, but I am really moping. Without Lydia around, we are going to get hit more in the face. Oh, and the light just went out. Turns out this room, and you in particular, Minty, are a lot creepier. Without the light. Feel I'm allowed. You guys reading this scroll, I feel I'm allowed to wallow a little bit. I think she's been the only person now here so far I would truly call a friend. And yeah, I know she was sworn to carry my burdens and all that. You know, it wasn't like a friendship friendship. It was kind of a weird. I've made a strange vow to end my life instead of yours type relationship. But still. She can call it that. I'm going to call it a French. There's just no control. I'll lift it up. Hmm. Oh! Jesus! Go! 
Oh, 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 that makes me so scared. Oh, God. Oh. Ah. Oops. Crap. Sorry, Minty. I'm really sorry. Oh. In my defense. I might need a new set of arc mage robes. Oh. Jesus, I was expecting that thing to pop. I don't get it. Alright, okay, I'm gonna put the candle light on. Because I think everything that's gonna completely scare me the hell out of me in this place is already done so. Oil. Lots of oil. Ah, wait. Candle. Candle. Ah, ha, ha. there we are. Potions, a scroll of hysteria, and an imperial light helmet. A steel dagger. I'm not sure there's any enchanting I'm completely desperate to do. Oh, I can learn a new spell. Any items I can conjure? Lydia's circlet. The emerald circlet. Made of... Orocalium. Enchant any of these things. They'll be worth more when we sell them. I don't think we're likely to use any of these. It's so interesting, though, isn't it? The idea that you can enchant an object in some way with a with magic, you know, and take something which is inanimate and static and make it something which is living. but I don't think I killed that one. It's hard to know which of the dead things in the tomb you killed or how many of them were dead already or how many how many you know others were killed before you kind of came along. You know Mindy? It's always a problem, isn't it? Always a problem. You have a really unhealthy glow, you know? It's not, I'm not saying it's not attractive. I'm just saying it's unhealthy. Gee. <laughs> I think yeah, your eyes your eyes need need rebooting. Frenzy potion, an open troll skull. And a ruined book. Yeah. Look my old play area back in the vault. For my next trick, I will discover the way down. I have sound. Do you hear that sound? It sounds almost like a machine. 